Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today guys, we're working on a Chevy Equinox for generation and we'll show you guys how to remove and replace the lock button right here. Okay, this one is not working, how to remove and replace it. Stay with us, it will be the same for Pontiac Torrent as well. Please subscribe guys, let's grow that channel together and let's go ahead and start on it now. So what we need to do next with a Phillips screwdriver, okay right there, there is a uh, screw that we need to remove, sometimes there is a cap on those. So all you have to do is just pry it out. Okay, and now we'll need to pull that thing out. Okay, you need to open it. So if you start on this side, it will be a little bit easier. Okay, there is a thing that you need to press in right there. Okay, and after that you need to open the handle and okay, slide it out. Okay, like that. Okay guys, so for the lock, you don't need to remove the door panel. We did it so we can show it and demonstrate better what it needs to be done. Okay, check it out now. There is four, four uh, things here, two on top, two on the bottom, that go in. Now it's important from here, from top, okay, you can press it in with a screwdriver, okay, and pull, pull the switch out of there. Okay, you can see like that. It's going to come out of there. Okay, now you press down on this and you pull the wire. Make sure you hold the wire so it doesn't fall in. Okay, and uh, all we have to do is just install this one, get the bottom part in first. You get the bottom part in, okay, and then you lock the top. So that's how you guys remove it and replace it. If it's not working, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe and see you next time.